The city of El Paso, located in the southwestern part of Texas, is not only recognized for Marty Robinson's song entitled El Paso, but it is also known for its homegrown heroes. We have had some outstanding people here in El Paso. We have the E Company of the 36th Infantry Division, which was the only company in the United States where everybody spoke Spanish. And they made quite a name for themselves in Italy. Other El Pasoans, besides those who served in E Company, have also answered our nation's calling. El Paso native Angel Romero and his four brothers served in World War II. Angel Romero participated in four campaigns and said each battle had its own unique trait, but what they had in common was the struggle to survive. The uh, Normandy campaign was the snipers, the heat and the humidity. Holland was wet all the time. At the Battle of the Bulge, we were always freezing. Uh, but, the, but the real battle is uh, having to put up fighting and trying to survive. Robert Chisholm first met Angel in 1943. Both men were assigned to the 508th Infantry Regiment during World War II. In our training, we were billeted right near one another. We saw each other two or three times a week and training all the time. And uh, so uh, our relationship has been quite long and enduring. Both veterans live in El Paso and remain active members of the 82nd Airborne's Benavides Patterson All Airborne Chapter. Reporting for Fort Bliss, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Diana Bagui.